from Nassau, Bahamas. This is Cruise News Today with Doug Parker. Here's your cruise news for Friday, March 11th, 2022. Royal Caribbean's Wonder of the Seas made its inaugural call in Nassau, Bahamas on Wednesday. The ship set sail on its inaugural seven-night voyage on March 4th out of Port Everglades. Other ports of call on this eastern Caribbean itinerary included Labadee, San Juan, and Royal Caribbean's private island, Perfect Day. Wonder of the Seas is part of the Oasis class and is currently the largest ship in the world. Wonder will spend the next few weeks sailing from Port Everglades before repositioning to the Mediterranean. And MSC Cruises has broken ground on its new $350 million terminal at Port Miami. When completed, the building will be the largest cruise terminal in North America, capable of accommodating three MSC large cruise ships at one time. The four-story building will include four embarkation decks and be able to handle up to 36,000 passengers per day. In partnership with Fincantieri Infrastructure, MSC Group will build two of the berths and Miami-Dade County will construct the third. The terminal is scheduled to be completed in late 2023. And finally, the Port of Nassau, Bahamas and Carnival Cruise Line celebrated its 50th birthday together. Leaders from the Bahamian government, Carnival Cruise Line, and others gathered for musical performances and a 50th birthday cake cutting. In addition, Carnival President Christine Duffy presented a $50,000 check to LJM Maritime Academy for equipment to support education for Bahamian maritime cadets. Today, the 11th, marks Carnival's 50th birthday. And cruise line stocks were up on Thursday. Carnival Corporation up 2.2%, 17.65. Royal Caribbean up the same, 69.53. And Norwegian up 3%, 17.82. Breaking news and industry coverage at cruiseradio.net. Here in Nassau, Bahamas, I'm Doug Parker with Cruise News Today. Cruise News Today is a production of Cruise Radio. For daily updates, subscribe to the Cruise Radio YouTube channel or visit cruiseradio.net.